behind the scenes, behind the lines, inside the stories others won't tell. The Morning Insiders. She paid in full and was left empty handed. A Markham woman is furious after a mega home improvement company leaves her hanging. Morning Insider Lauren Victory explains why her project is no longer on the fence. Happy birthday to you. Kane is already king of the house. I'm new to this grand puppy thing, but I've fallen in love with him. Now grandma wants to give him the royal treatment in her yard. I thought it would have been so pretty. A white vinyl fence would also spruce up Crystal Randall's barbecues and fish fries. It's security. It's security. Privacy. Yes. And it sounded fancy. Yeah, <laughs> I thought it was gorgeous. I was so disappointed though. You see, Randall hired Home Depot to build the six foot high barrier in October. Home Depot passed the job along to its contractor, Peerless Fence Group. He came and measured everything, wrote everything down and, and then gave me a price. And charged her Home Depot credit card on the spot. A total of $10,399. Paying in full ahead of a job is something the Illinois Attorney General advises against. Nevertheless, Peerless tells us Home Depot requires them to collect 100% up front. But what about this other request that the homeowner get Peerless a permit? I've had windows, roofs done on the home. They've all obtained their own permit. I've never had to do that, but fine, I wanted the fence. Her trip to Markham Village Hall didn't go well. They haven't registered with the city of Markham for over a year. Their bonding, licensure, and liability has also expired. Peerless acknowledges the lapse, telling us it doesn't do much business in Markham. A company administrator shared an email chain showing their attempts to update village paperwork took weeks. Because in the meantime, I'm still getting invoices from Home Depot to pay on this fence that I don't have. Randall wants the whole job canceled and a refund on her Home Depot credit card. Nobody called me from corporate. I sent certified letters letting them know my situation. No response. Looks like the one getting the runaround isn't Kane. In Markham, Lauren Victory, CBS 2 News. Well, after CBS 2 got in touch with Peerless Fence, the company called Randall and offered her a full refund. They tell us their paperwork is still waiting on approval to do work in the village of Markham. Home Depot confirms it requires customers to pay its contractors in full before any work is done, but did not explain why. For more stories like this, download our new CBS Chicago app and look for the Morning Insiders section.